well, good morning on this damp, damp, dreary, wet. Can I have, think of another adjective? Cold morning. It is Monday, April 16th. Tax day is tomorrow, but I'm already done. I've already got that. I already got my refund back and all ready to spend it. I, um, I started off so well yesterday. I posted on Instagram because I'm learning Instagram. I posted on Instagram my breakfast and I had a really healthy lunch and then it went bad. I had, um, what did I eat? I had some candy. I had some uh, multi-grain, at least they were multi-grain, ha ha ha, multi-grain um, Dorito scoops with some salsa, which was zero points, but then I had uh, a 20 ounce 7-Up. Uh, I just had a craving for pop, but I didn't have the Pepsi or the Coke because I knew that that would send me into a tailspin. But the, it, it craved my sugar craving. And so maybe it wasn't as bad as I thought, but it wasn't as good as it could have been. But it's a whole new week. Yeah, I have to start thinking the Saturdays and Sundays is like a, a Samoan day and a Sawan day. It's like a Monday, Tuesday, Monday, it's a Tuesday. Anyway. I also would like to have a big, sincere, sincere apology to Sandy Chapman, One Pound at a Time, is the name of her channel. I somehow missed her birthday. I don't know how that happened, but I did. I missed her birthday, and I feel so bad because I, I looked again to see in my calendar, and I didn't have it in my calendar, not how I how I messed that up. I, I apologize, Sandy, but you know, you still get a song. Oh my gosh. It's officially spring. The first bunny. I wish I could have picked the camera around to show you. We don't have squirrels in our neighborhood. We have bunnies. And when the bunnies show, that means spring is so close. And I got distracted. And, and it really, no, it wasn't a squirrel. Well, in my neighborhood, squirrel. Because bunny. <laughs> anyway, back to Sandy. And with a name like Sandy, how could I have forgotten that? I don't know. I just don't know. The birthday gods are like saying, Sandy. How could you have done that? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sandy Chapman. One pound at a time. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. I had to give her some extra cha cha chas because I missed her birthday. I just feel so bad. Hmm. Oh well. Um. And also Valerie Reese, I'd like to report to you that I did, I told you on your vlog, on your update, that I thought I walked 20 miles. <laughs> I was dreaming. I must have done that in my dream because I only walked 13.6. And not only, that's pretty good for five days, 13.6. But it's nowhere near the 20 miles that I said I did walk. I was bragging and look at bragging for nothing because I didn't do it. But I walked 13.6 last week. Uh, which means I've walked a total of 53.5, but I only have 46.5 to go. And what's today I said was the 16th, and I only have two weeks to do that. So that means I would have to walk almost 23 miles this week and next week. I don't see that happening, but I'm going to come pretty darn close. Pretty, pretty darn close. Because even at that, I'll only miss it by 20 miles, which isn't as bad. But still... But you know what? You never know. You never know. I might get some burst of energy and walk both Saturday and Sunday, both this week and next week, and that'll give me an extra, what, 5, 10, 10. So I'll only miss it by 10 miles then. Oh, well, I'm going to come close. Uh, when I get back, this is early, by the way. I'll probably see the kids walk into school because uh, Jim got called in to work early today. And so when Jim's up, It was, <laughs> I was making fun of him yesterday because uh, I'm usually the first one up. Jim usually sleeps in, and he's usually the one that has to make the bed because he's the last one to get up. But for some reason on Saturday, I had insomnia, and uh, I knew I wasn't going to go to church because of the ice storm we had yesterday, and I didn't uh, obviously go to church because I didn't want to take a chance. God understands. So I didn't go to church because of the ice that was everywhere. It was so pretty. Uh, all the ice. I should have took a film of it because yeah, I love the look of it. I don't like the you know the damage that it does. Where was I going with this? Oh, so I had insomnia, 
So I actually didn't get to bed till, oh, it had been like five or six o'clock in the morning. And uh, so I was sleeping, I was really tired. And then Jim got up at 10 and I still wasn't up at 11. And I was joking with him because I kind of was rolling around and I kind of was half awake at 11. And I heard him making his uh, breakfast. And then after he got done with his breakfast, he came in and he saw that I was playing on my phone. And he says, oh, I was going to wait till after I uh, had breakfast to come in to make sure you were still alive. I said, oh, we're going to eat first. He says, well, yeah, because, you know, that would be all involved, calling the 911 and having the police come and filling out all the reports. I wouldn't want to do that on an empty stomach. <laughs> That's why I love him so much. We're so much alike. I would have done the same thing. <laughs> um, and now I see a rabbit. The, the ice storm was the break, the break we needed, because now it's all, well, it's all good news. So Carrie had, couldn't get to her meeting on Saturday because she had so much snow. I think she ended up, she said they were supposed to end up with 30 inches of snow. Oh, she can keep it. She can keep it, Carrie. I don't want it. And she sent me a text that showed me her halfway up her window with the snow. But anyway, she's supposed to be like 55 tomorrow and it's going to start melting. So she should get to her meeting next week. All right. Another plant. Did I tell you my plants for the day? Yeah, my might as well. Uh, when I get back from my walk, I'm going to take a shower, and then I'm going to bring Denise. She's, uh, Gary's having trouble with his car, so she's got to bring the car to the mechanic, and then I have to follow her and drive her home. I'm going to go to Kroger's, and I think I'm going to make this chicken enchilada for dinner. I'm going to try to tweak it a little bit so it'll be Weight Watcher friendly, and that's it. My only plans for the day. So let's go for our walk, and... Uh, Try not to fall because there might be little patches of ice, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to brave it. I'll talk to you guys when I get back. All right, I'm back. I walked 2.8 and uh, it wasn't slippery, but it was wet. There was a lot of puddles, so my feet are wet. So I'm going to go in and take my shower, put some dry socks on, put my shoes by the heater to dry, and drink my water and then go pick up Denise and get on with my day. Probably have to go to Kroger's because I gotta get the ingredients for that chicken. The buck buck chicken! And uh, get on with my day. I'd, there's nobody out. Didn't see, you know, I, by the time I got around to where the school was, the kids were already in school. So I missed them too. But it was a nice walk. I enjoyed it. Glad I went. I'm tired though. You know, when you don't walk for two days, you kind of feel it when you start back. But, you know, I started back. That's all that matters. Okay, let's go in the house. I have to start with my breakfast making up for yesterday because I was bad. So I have a zero point breakfast. Uh, I started my day with a prayer. I drank 50 ounces of water. My quote is, remember it's progress, not perfection, because I was not perfect yesterday. So it's a zero point breakfast for my berries, egg, banana, grapefruit, tea, and water. So I still have 24 points left. I'm going to enjoy this. I know it's heavy on the fruit, obviously, but I'm going to do it. Okay, I need to get a job at Taco Bell so I can learn how to wrap these things, because I don't know how to do it. And I'm going to have some refried beans and my chicken enchilada. It's seven points for a three-quarters cup of chicken enchilada, one point for my extreme wrap, three points for my two tablespoons of sour cream, one point for my two tablespoons of olives, and zero for my tea, the water, and the refried fat-free beans. Uh, the chicken enchilada was actually very good. I ended up, though, um, it was too hard to pick up in the wrap, so what I did was I scraped it off of the wrap and put it into that bowl of... Um, the refried beans and ate it that way. It was way better. Way, way, way better. Jim ate his with a knife and fork. And he really liked it. I was surprised. He had four of them. Uh, I started him off with two, but he asked for two more. And what else? I did do the recipe. I'm not really good at filming, but, you know, you can see how, how I did it. It I had ended up, I have... Um, four little three-quarter cup uh, servings that I put in the freezer. I don't know how well it's going to freeze. I'm going to try it to see how well it does. But, um, you know, I'm going out to dinner tomorrow because I'm going with my brother and my sisters out for uh, dinner. And uh, so I'm going to have another zero-point breakfast probably. 
I, I did very poorly yesterday. I told you that earlier. That um, So i got to make up the, during the week. Why is it that I can do it during the week, but I can't do it on the weekends? I, I wish I could figure that out. That's I struggle with that. I really struggle. Because I, I go so crazy on Saturday and Sunday, and then I go Monday through Friday doing makeup. And it's... I'm not at a maintenance program yet. <laughs> Maybe if I was just on maintenance, it wouldn't be so bad. But uh, no, I'm trying to lose weight. You'd never know it, but I am. I'm really, I'm trying to lose weight. And I'm not having too much success with that. But I'm going to get better at it. And I was at the gas station and somebody asked me for directions on how to get to the police department. And I didn't know how to get there. <laughs> Which is good. I, pro I probably. But uh, we were across the street from the courthouse. And so I told him, I said, you know, why don't you check at the courthouse because uh, otherwise I think it's down the other way, which it was. But uh, I did see him pull into the courthouse. So they would be able to give him a better, at least I didn't send him way out of the way. It was just across the street. And um, what else was there today? And then Denise and I went and did a little bit of grocery shopping. And I've just been sitting around here now, just not doing very much. I'm going to walk again tomorrow. We're supposed to get some snow and ice tonight, but I think in the morning by the time I roll out of bed, <laughs> it'll be okay to go for a walk. I did find a different little route that I'm going, and it did increase my... from. I went from a 2.7 to 2.8. And that, was, that wasn't too bad. I really... I was kind of nice with that. I kind of liked it. And a little bit different view, which I always like a little bit different view. It'll be nice when there's more people out and I can see them and I can talk because I like to talk. <laughs> I didn't know if you knew that about me, but I do. I do like to talk. I'll talk to anybody. I, I talk to people in the grocery store whether they want to talk to me or not. I don't, I don't really care. And I felt bad because this one guy, he, his um, motorized scooter uh, died in the middle of the store. And I said, well, let me go get you another one. And he just kind of looked at me like he thought I was trying to pick him up or something. I'm thinking, I'm just trying to be nice, buddy. He said, no, no, it'll be fine, it'll be fine, it'll be fine, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. <laughs> and then he did get it going, but uh, I don't know that he had enough to get through the rest of the store. But I thought, you know, I was willing to help. I, you know, And I even told him, I said, if you want me to get it for you. Because, you know, a lot of times I forget that I'm old. Because I don't feel old. I really don't feel old. But I'm sure that people look at me and they think, you know, I should be helping you. You're old. Why, why are you trying to help me? But he looked like he was about my age. But... Um, he didn't want my help, so I offered. It's all you can do. It's all you can do is offer. Okay. I'm going to get my pajamas on, watch some TV with Jim. He's probably going to go to bed early because he's going to be working days this week. And um, so he'll go to bed earlier. So we'll watch a couple shows. I don't know why you needed to know that, but I thought I'd share. So oh, I will see you tomorrow. Give this video a big thumbs up. You know, my thumb is still kind of like a trigger thumb, kind of popping. Uh, share if you think it'll help somebody. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. And um, I guess that's it. Oh, leave a comment. You know, it's like we're talking back and forth. So I'll see you guys in the morning. I'll see, I'll start filming in the morning. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow night. <laughs>